Good day, lords and ladies, and welcome back to Pillars of Eternity with me, Cornus Knight, as we get back into the campaign. Yeah. Um, yes, I know it's a bad idea to go up the stairs to where all the blood is, but still, I haven't got much of a choice. Blood pool. As you approach the blood pool, viscous liquid churns and bubbles. You feel essence rising to the surface, reaching out to you, whispering. Someone can clean that up, mutters Adar. Elof, some strange power seems to be animate, animating, animating the blood. I go, I'm going to hazard a guess and say that whatever it is isn't benevolent. A place of death. We should not linger here. Durance, a bubbling cold in the skurn's hateful seed. He may be sniveling, sniveling cowardly in his way, but he has never lacked for focus. Extend your soul to the blood pool. A faint whisper resolves into a cough in your voices. You Im image, imagine. You image yourself, imagine yourself, surrounded by a hundred of men and women. Their naked, their naked flesh is scorched and bloody, their skins and covered with flies. Their eyes are missing, they're replaced with glittering black stones. A voice cries out in unison, what's this? Another soul come to rage and burn on Millie to watch. You may be long time in waiting, a work today is already finished. You were all sacrificed to Skurn, weren't you? The wind's voice replies, we were sacrificed to the whims of the hungers of the rich and powerful, but what we gave gave here was our decision. They hover at your soul's heads, feeling you out. Our fury burned within us, unquenched, unfed, but hate can be fas fashioned into a weapon by those willing to pay the price. Another voice speaks, in life we were weak, but in death we make our choice. Choices, ca choices carries power. What kind of power? What kind of power you can escape your oppressors and move on? The power for revenge, yes, to exact justice. To defend, the, to defend innocents like you, what kind of power? The voice cackles, if you must ask, then you have never had need of revenge. They probe the branch of yourself, exploring your essence. You also know the potency of cruelty. One voice whispers, we have a proposal that might suit you. Another low, silky chimes in. It is so rare that we touch the soul of another, we grow bored, hungry. You hear a third voice, trembling at the edge of sanity give us one of your companions any of them that the essence of another join us and we will share that power with you no one will ever know you need only thank think the name and we shall give us the power to strike your chosen down i won't do this i don't want to give up one of my party members for this i won't do this then go we are not left we are not we have nothing left to share Okay, the pool is quiet. So let me guess, we'd have to give up one of our companions for this. The corpse bent forward as if watching her blood, lifeblood trickle away. Can do. It's way up there. The man's arms are cut open at the elbow to from elbow to wrist. Ooh, that's a that's nasty way to go. So, yeah, so if we'd sacrificed one of our party members, we could have got something. Uh, I don't... Crew Timbal's blood, planting in blood. Body con congeals blood under this... Sorry, blood congeals under this corpse's slit throat. So if we'd sacrificed one of our party members, we would have got... Yeah, but I don't want to sacrifice one. I suppose if I had one of the... I suppose if I had one of the DLC party members in the party, I could have done it. Just say the word. I suppose that would have worked if I'd had a DLC party member because they're not as useful. Get the key. Okay, that. Excuse my second, folks. Sorry about that, folks. The phone went. These cabinets are, f are finely crafted from deep rich wood, however, many of these cells are broken from years of rough use. Just say the word. Okay. Small wicker statues with black stone eyes are placed between the flickering candles. Something over there. Right, Sturance, go disarm it. I suppose I should have just said Vengeance. It was very obvious what they were getting out of this deal. Like, oh yeah. Vengeance, Revenge, God of Vengeance. No, 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 no. no. What? 
try and get this one done. Okay, so it's, so it's going to be a one person by one person approach then. Something over there. Okay. Something hidden there. Hey. I have to send them up one by one. It's gonna suck though if we have Just say the word. If we're gonna have to um Yeah, sorry. I was going to say, it's going to suck, yes. though, if we're going to have to either come back this way or have to fight our way out of this way, because it's going to be a really nasty fight. Yeah. The sound of bells. I do like her character. Must flow deeply indeed. Hmm. Uh, I mean, they are useful. Temple Guard, Mindbreaker. Okay. Hi. Well, let's start this. Hi. Actually, if we think about it. Um. Who picked up the scroll? Wall of Fire spell. Saves me using a spell slot. Because these guys are a pain. Love. Love, love. Out they come. Right, attack. Attack. Right. Get that person. Get that up on that person. She can get this up on this one. Now oh, he shot him and he still stood up. Good for you. Right, so if that's the case... Get them with that. Health is low. Oh, something summoned it. Ah, that was what it was. Where did that temple for Kinatic come from? Go beat down him. Oh, they're coming in the back as well. Last him up good. There we go. The fanatic is dead. Excellent. Heal her up. Just say the word. Again, a lot of I won't say pointless stuff, but leave it to me. Oh, he was an Alamar. He was one of those sea people. 
Right. I'll go on ahead. If I want to sneak. Probably some stuff around here that I've missed. There doesn't seem to be a door. This elegant vase is cracked, chipped. It looks antique from Adria. So these guys have been around a long time. Crypt Master's key. And there's a lot of them, that's for sure. Wade and Wumd. A large, bulky necked man in a hood helps the young elf woman drop down from a glass chamber connected to a distant array of cables and machinery. Her skin and clothing glisten with fresh blood. I may feel a little light headed for the next hour or two, but that will pass. Have a meal and get some sleep when you return to town. The transfusion. <laughs> the girl sobs into the back of her hand. The transfusion will be smoothest if you relax and rest. The implanted essence already has a hold on your mind. So fighting it will be useless. Turns to you. I hope our new visitor does not complicate matters overly. What's going on here? Subversion. The black sheep cousin of justice. Or haven't you heard Lord Heron's tale of woe about a missing daughter and an impending marriage? He's sent his soldiers to scour the village while he bides his time at the Dracogen Inn. Word of the bloody trail you leave in your wake has reached even my ears. You of all people should understand what I'm doing. Polite society frowns on your extremes as much as they do my animancy and scans rituals. But unsightliness reminds polite society that there are limits. When no one pays attention to the excesses and debaucheries of a lord, you give them something they can't look away from. Harriet said he was taking her to Est Rest to find a suit, but a few pieces of his story didn't add up. Did a bit of digging, did you? That's more than can be said for most. Lord Heron's been telling everyone she's his daughter. He brought her all the way out here just to avoid anyone who might know differently. She's his niece, and she's carrying his child. He, he's her own flesh and blood, that's the vilest thing I've ever heard. Why would he do that? Heron's own wife's delivered nothing but Hollowborn. Now he's got no heir, and his sister's child, Elise, is reaching the age to marry. Without progeny of his own, Heron's legacy would pass to her issue. So, he found a way to continue his own noble line. And by putting his child in this girl, his own niece, couldn't he have got a child by by some other means? Not a highborn heir. Even if he disposed of his own wife by some means, what family would marry their fertile daughter off to him? You can see the problem with this foolishness about blood and birth, I hope. And the animants, uh, an animants is part of the plan to destroy him? This isn't just about hair and the girl. It's about the corrupting influences of power and wealth. How people of privilege, people like Herond, are so often insulated from the consequences of their actions. The charged essence of dozens of maltreated slaves and underlings is already taking root in her mind. Once it's established, it'll drive her to murder her uncle, her aunt, and anyone foolish enough to get in her way. People won't be able to look away from Heron's sins then. Seems like a lot of trouble to go to when a simple lynch mob would do. They didn't get a lot of things right, but this kind of thing they know what to do with. I do not wish to destroy Nestor Herond. I wish to end his entire rotten line. His name will become a curse among strangers. The deeds of his house will be eclipsed by his ruin. Foes will hear his name and shudder with pity. And any relatives who should survive him will abandon their fortunes just to rid themselves of the association. You're hot-blooded, willful, but there is no room for mercy and vengeance. What? Do not let this girl and her child become a fodder for revenge. Let me touch her mind. I can free her from this snare as well as from the memories that, her, that hold her captive. Do it. Yeah, the thing is, like, I'm... I believe, like, if you're... Like, if with this kind of thing, like, okay, so he hates the Lord. Just go up and kill the Lord. Like, why do you have to take out the whole line? I mean... 
he's not done anything personal to this bloke. It just seems to be a religious creed that he wants to purge the bloke's line. Just he could have just like literally gone and killed him himself, but he's doing it via proxy. And I, I always, in the, if you, I'm playing a vengeance paladin for Peter's sake. Vengeance paladin is all about doing it yourself. Like if you're going to kill someone, you go up to them, you stab them through the front, not through the back. The group of mother bows her head. Thank you, watcher. You feel her reach out, persistent, persistent yet gently. Aya does not move, but the grieving mother trembles with ex exertion, and the air around her rings with the sound of chimes. As last she collapses, her energy spent, the strain throbs her mind. For a moment, Aya's ears close, when they open again, her pressing is blank, but she has taken in the scene before her. You, woman, the machinery in this strange, dark room, her confusion turns to fear, she lets out a choked cry. Kill them. All of them. If she can't destroy Heron, then we can destroy his legacy with her. Right. So we're all, all out. Right, we've also got taxes. Excellent. Um, first of all... Get her confused. You go for the preacher. Pop this down. You go for them. You for go for them. Uh, what do we want? We want something that will stop their movement. That will do. Actually, wait, we can do mind control, can't we? Charm her. Lady, please don't hit me. Go for him. You go for him. Die. She's got to die if we're not careful. Okay. I need you to do a heal on her. Great, the kid died. Okay. What a waste. Okay. This is annoying. I wish I'd been able to save her. Oh well. What a waste. We lost a kid. Blood Legacy. Lady Oda has disappeared into the quiet town of Deerfoot. Um, let's see. Is there, I take it she's dead. I suppose we could have tried to save her. I don't know how he would have done it. Woman's Key. Just say the word. Cables okay, sneak through the floor and cross the ceilings to connect to a glowing glass ch chamber. Can do. Thick liquid bubbles inside the tank, releasing pungent scent. Atunk, atunk, atuk. The blade of of or onetic origin. Atuk's skinning knife was a gift passed from mother to daughter. Used to remove hides from various hardy creatures of the tundra. It is precisely designed to pierce vulnerable joints and cut deeply and cleanly into flesh, making it a fearsome weapon against less traditional game as well. Okay, and what's the worm's notebook? The looping scribble are difficult to read, but you flip through the pages, you can begin to make out some page, um, passages near the beginning you read. 
will be suitable place for my experiments. The abundance of space and more importance, the locals are content to ignore it. I could probably construct, you skip ahead several pages, willing volunteers, the legacy has brought many grievances to the surface and capturing the essence of pri is primarily the matter of timing. The ritual effigy serves as a good temple for you scan in the middle of the book. Died and the essence is evaporated. Next time I have to try a smaller concentration of reagent until you read you turn to the last page. Noble from the Fine Spay results were mostly consistent across the other subjects. The challenge is always to apply this method to an unwilling participant, but her situation may prove advantageous. If I can bring those memories to her uncle to the forefront, it might render her essence more susceptible to the process. Okay, so he was a jackass. Well, I knew he was a jackass anyway, but uh, now he's just a double jackass. Okay. Collects an earned lost. And what does the flame reveal? Bunch of jewelry. Anoic crest de decorates this sarcophagus. The name of the lid has been scratched away. I bet it's the the noble, the 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 previous earl. Need something? Just say the word. Right. We still got some places to explore that I want to check out before we go back. I wish we could have tried to save her. I, I suspect we could have probably saved her if we were being careful about it. But I don't know how you could have done it because he turned hostile straight away. Just say the word. Because he was mind controlling her. Uh, maybe we could have done a calm thing or something. How may I help? Your thoughts must flow deeply indeed. Nah, don't worry. We'll get justice for the girl anyway. We'll go up there and kill her uncle. I mean, to be honest, he could have just had a kid out of wedlock. Like, literally. Or he could have brought someone into the family line. I mean, that was something that was historically yes. done. Um, and the whole thing, oh, he couldn't find someone of noble birth. He could have gone outside the country and found someone. Because it seems that this Polarborn thing only affects yeah. those inside I'll the kingdom. So if he left, he could have probably got someone pregnant. So, yeah, I mean, I, I don't like it per se. I mean, it just seems like he took a really disturbing option out. I mean, he could have done a multiple things. I mean, hell, he could have basically approached the noble family outside the cap, outside the kingdom and said, look, I really need an heir. If you allow me to have a child outside of wedlock, they will be inheriting my 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 um my inheriting everything. So I'm pretty sure that someone would have accepted that. Surprise. Okay, no, not surprise. Nothing will slip past me. I thought it was a surprise, but apparently it was not. Okay. FG's made a several Just crooked... Say the word. Where the hell does this go? Upper level? Okay. I take it this sneaks around this way. So you avoid a lot of the traps. Annoying my luck, he's got to come walking through the door any moment now. How may I help? So why the hell do I have Just my wizard out in front? Yep, and there's a whole group of them. But I want to kill this this coat. Just They're really the getting word. on my nerves. Not a fan of them at all. Need something? Surprise! Don't think you ever thought you'd see me here. Hi. Surprise, fools. Keep an eye out. Right, they're gonna come out of here super pissed. So yeah, there's a 
the bing to indicate they're coming. Yes. We hit them with that. We'll hit them with... Yeah, we'll hit them with poison gas. Hit them with that. They've dropped that on our heads. It's not a huge issue. We'll pop this. You can pop that. Hmm. Video only has, only has level. Really? Okay. I thought he had more spells than that, but I must have been mistaken. Right, you've got him there. You shoot him in the face. Oh, we're in Toxin, that's why. Pop the healing aura. Bunch of stuff. Yeah. At this point, I'm just literally raiding for the sake of raiding. Ouch, that hurt. Okay, so that goes up there. Oh, that's where we're going slowly on slow speed. That sucks. Right, okay. I take it these are more. Yeah, it's more. These they 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 sub they pushed them in here. Everyone who donated to the game got a name in here, so it took up a lot of space. Effigies are made of several crooked sticks. The yeah, word. so it's the weird effigy thing. Could have. Oh, wow. What did I turn up? Deerford Crossing. That was a surprise. Priest. Priest! Just my luck. Get that up. Get this up. And go and stab that guy in the face. If you'd be so kind. Right, it's dead. Where did we come out at? Not a problem. Just say the word. Deerford Crossing. Oh man, we're all the way out here. Okay, that's worrying. Um, we're going to have to end it here, folks. I seem to have gone slightly in the wrong direction. Um, if you have liked, please press the like button. If you have subscribed, please press the subscription button. As we run back to town to enforce our to enforce our righteous fury on people. Um, because they really deserve it. And I'll see you all next time, folks. Goodbye.